Welcome to NASDAQ Trade Talks. I'm Jill Malandrino, Global Markets Reporter at NASDAQ. Joining me at the market site in Times Square, New York City, we have Peggy Mango. She's a Senior Vice President of Innovation over at Wells Fargo, and we're going to learn more about Wells Fargo and women in fintech and support that the company is offering them. It's great to have you with us at Market Thanks Welcome. for having me. And tell us more about the innovation initiatives that you have going on at Wells Fargo. Sure. So uh, our enterprise organization supports uh, accelerating existing initiatives, proof of concepts with fintechs or other type of companies. And then sometimes we actually lead change, transformational change for Wells Fargo. We also have the Wells Fargo Startup Accelerator, uh, where we actually fund up to $1 million um, different types of startups that we think will either be successful in the industry or successful in partnership with Wells Fargo. All right, now Wells Fargo, you are a presenting sponsor for the Female Founders in FinTech competition for the second year in a row. What makes you decide to do that? Oh, the absolute quality of the companies that we saw last year, the quality's gotten even better, and uh, especially global. Uh, we've seen a lot of global companies uh, come through the program. And you know what, they, they just happen to be female founders. For uh, female founders in the industry, mentorship opportunities is really key in providing them some support. Um, well, how is that important to be able to mentor them, to provide partnership, to be able to lend that support to females in particular? It's absolutely crucial. And, and that's because what we all know and see, there's not enough female leaders, whether it's board seats, whether it's uh, CEOs, whether it's uh, on, the, on, on the senior, senior leadership of large financial institutions, there's not enough women role models. So it's especially important for us as an industry, uh, as, as a country, for us to be pulling up and partnering with uh, the, the fintech women founders because those are the large FIs of the future, or some of them will be. So awesome. it's very important to uh, mentor, cultivate, and help them be as successful as they can. All right, now speaking of the future, what's your best advice for young female entrepreneurs within the fintech space? Um, well, it, it's, it's similar to the advice I would give to any startup founder. Do, start a, a, a fintech or start, start a company that you are absolutely passionate about because it is a marathon and then surround yourself with people that are also committed to that vision and that mission. Do you think it's getting better with women in fintech? Is the industry improve, improving overall? I absolutely think it's getting better, but it's important for us to continue to reach out to support one another, um, even just from a providing connections, network, um, as well as, of course, financial All support. Right. Well. That's why we're excited to have you here. We spread that word. Peggy, thank you so much for joining us at Market Site. Thank you. And thank you for joining me on Trade Talks. I'm Jill Malentrino, Global Markets Reporter at NASDAQ.